Most men with early prostate cancer that's contained inside the prostate don't have any signs or symptoms. We often get asked why this is the case. One reason for this is the way the cancer grows. You'll usually only get symptoms if the cancer grows near and presses against the urethra. This is the tube you urinate through. When this happens, it changes the way you urinate or wee. But because prostate cancer usually starts to grow in a different part, usually the outer part of the prostate, early prostate cancer often doesn't press on the urethra and cause any symptoms. For this reason, it's very important to be aware of your risks, which are being over 50, having black ethnicity, and having a family history of prostate cancer. If you do notice changes in the way you urinate, this is more likely to be a sign of an enlarged prostate, which is a very common non-cancerous condition in older men, or another health problem rather than prostate cancer. But it's still important to get it checked out with your GP to find the cause of any changes. The sort of changes to look out for would be if you're having to urinate a lot more during the day, and when you go, perhaps having trouble starting or noticing a weak flow. You might feel like you're not able to empty your bladder properly and you've got some dribbling afterwards. You may even find that you're having to get up several times at night to empty your bladder, which you weren't doing before. And you might need to urinate urgently or may leak urine before you get to the toilet. If prostate cancer breaks out of the prostate or spreads to other parts of your body, that can cause different symptoms, such as constant pain in bony areas, such as the back or hips. Again, there are other more common reasons why men would have pain, especially older men, such as conditions like arthritis, for example. Other less common symptoms that can sometimes arise with prostate cancer is if men notice blood in their urine or in their semen. These again could be the result of other conditions, such as infection, but it's important to get it checked by your GP. Other less common symptoms of prostate cancer are problems getting or keeping an erection, and some men lose weight without trying to or without a reason. Although these symptoms are probably caused by other health conditions, it's always a good idea to get in touch with your GP. If you notice any of these symptoms or have any changes that are unusual for you, your GP can find out what's causing them and make sure you have the right investigations or treatment should you need it. You can also contact our specialist nurses if you're unsure about any symptoms or if you need help with what to say to your GP we have a form on our website that you can fill and show to your GP to help start the conversation. You can find out more about risks in our film, What are the risk factors for prostate cancer? You can use our 30 second risk checker tool to find out if you're at risk on our website, prostatecanceruk.org. You can speak to our specialist nurses on 0800 074 8383.